I'm Sherry Soria from Living Light Culinary Institute. Today I'm going to share with you a recipe from my book Angel Foods. It's one of my summertime favorites. In fact, I'm going to make some today for our staff picnic. It's called Mexican Corn and Avocado Salad. This is just bright and beautiful and so fresh. Here we have some corn that I took off of the, off of the cob just using a knife. And you know, you could use frozen corn if you wanted to. I'm also using some fresh bell peppers that are diced and seeded and some cherry tomatoes. You could also use um, any kind of Roma tomatoes as long as they're diced, that would be fine. I'm going to add some cilantro, and if you, can't, if you can't take cilantro, and some people can't, you could certainly use any kind of leafy green. Um, even, even chopped up um, romaine lettuce would be just fine. And here I'm going to be adding some avocado, but I'm going to hold off on that until I toss everything together. That's going to be the last thing that I put in. So I'm going to toss that together a little bit first, and then I'm going to add some of my flavor enhancers. And here they are. A little bit of olive oil, just a tablespoon. Also a, ta a, a teaspoon, or half a teaspoon, depends on what your tastes are for salt. This is Himalayan crystal salt. A little bit of lime juice, or you could use lemon juice if you couldn't find lime juice. I'm adding some jalapeno pepper, and it's red and ripe, which is so nice to have in the summertime. Um, but you could leave that out if your palate doesn't allow you to eat chili peppers. And I'm going to add a little bit of garlic as well. And I like garlic, so I'm going to add a whole clove. A clove of garlic is about a half a teaspoon when it's pureed using the microplaner like this. Little tap takes care of that. And we'll just toss all of this together, and then we'll add our avocado. This smells so wonderful. And as I said, you can vary this in many different ways. You can add different vegetables depending on what you like. I actually like to add pumpkin seeds to this mixture as well. It adds a nice little crunch and um, a little change of texture. Mm, doesn't that look beautiful and fresh? You can see why I like to take it to picnics. It's just, it really speaks to you of summer. Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm going to choose to put it in a leaf pattern bowl, just because I love the color of this. Oops, that's a piece of the corn. That just goes to show you that I use fresh corn. <laughs> you always want to add a little quality control um, when you're doing something like this. Don't let anything like that past you. Oh, that is so, so beautiful. You know, sometimes I add uh, chili powder to this as well, which you certainly could do if you wanted. Mm. You know, that probably is all I need there. And in fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to enjoy the rest of it, since it doesn't fit in the bowl. I'm just going to have a little bowl of it myself. So, save a little bit for the chef. The chef sometimes takes the the ends of, of everything, but this chef is going to get the best of it. <laughs> All right. Mm, wonderful. So this is what the guests will have right there. And here is my beautiful, fresh summer salad. Mm. That is so good. This is Sherry Soria coming to you from Living Light Culinary Institute helping you make healthy living delicious.